What up, people? This video is supposed to be a quick tutorial on how to do your own nails, and I already know there's like a bajillion on YouTube right now because ever since the virus hit, you know, we're not going to the shop to get our nails done, and I haven't gone since the virus hit. So I just want to put another video out there to show how you can do your own nails at home. You know, from nail kits that you can get off of Amazon. And this will be a voiceover because my mic didn't even record. So, I'm gonna mess this up. Okay, so let's get started. So right now I'm just showing you the different colors that Beatles have. This is like a silvery set. Well, can't really see because I don't know how to be in frame, you know what I mean? Yeah, there we go. That's a silvery set or a gray tone set. Not even silvery, so just a gray tone. They got fall tone, summer, and right here you see a spring, you know, light paste pastel colors. I can't speak. Um, yeah, they're like super affordable and they come in like what, a pack of six. There are some that come in like a pack of like, what, 15 or something, but they're uh, tinier than uh, a regular pack of six. But yeah, you can check them out on Amazon. Also, these, uh, I don't know what you call them. It's like, it's where you place the fake. Uh, nail tips on it's like a little nail stand also off of Amazon and I use little white ticky tacks or whatever so the nail can stick on to the to those things otherwise I don't know the nail won't stick okay so the nail tips I use were um, the brand Beatles like am I gonna put it in frame or what I guess not so this comes from this come from these has like a multiple different uh, Jesus Lord okay there are multiple different sizes in this pack right here. So I think it goes from like zero to like what, nine? You know, the smaller number, the bigger the nail is, and the higher number, the smaller the nail is. So basically you just literally pick up a nail and measure it from nail bed to nail bed. Like, you know, make sure it covers your entire nails. Now, not all nails are treated or created obviously the same, you know? Oh, I'm just showing you like where you can find the number at, but I don't know why I do that because you can't even see it. Um, but it'll be at the tip, like underneath the nail, if you want to see like what sizing was what. Now, back to what I was saying, yeah, not all nails um, are made equally. So sometimes the fake nail won't even cover your entire nail. And if you get one bigger, you can easily file it down to where it'll fit your nail shape. So it's okay if you get a size bigger. But if it's too small, then like it's really obvious. So I would just go with a bigger size or get one close to your natural nail bed size as possible. Yeah, basically right here I'm just, you know, measuring my nails and seeing what fit on what. I think on this set, one was my thumbs, and then I think three were like my index finger, four, no, four, number four was like my index and ring finger, and number three was my middle finger, and then like my pinky was, I don't know, a size six or something like that. For the most part, I actually like this quality. Some um, companies that sell the nail tips, uh, they're not really sturdy. They will bend easily, break easily. From what I've read from other reviews, all the ones that I have bought myself, none of them have like broken or broke at all, I should say. Like, not even when I uh, cut it to clip it, none of them have broke on me, so. I don't know, just read the reviews. So this one, each set that Beatles carry comes with a base gel and a top coat. And then if you get one that comes with a kit, it also comes with a matte um, 
top coat. So what I mean by the kit, like this little UV light, I bought the first one, my first set. It came in like, what, 15 colors and it was like uh, red fall colors and greens and stuff like that. And um, it came with a, its own UV lamp, you know? So you can find those for like about $30 I think on Amazon and the numbers go for like 30 seconds, 60 seconds to 120 seconds. So for the top and base coat, no. I think they're the same, 60 seconds or more. Yeah, I know the base, I think the base is like 60 or 90, and then the top is probably 90 or 120. So, I don't know, just read on the directions when you get it. So, basically, right now, I'm just gonna apply the base gel and then cure it for the proportionate amount, which is like what, 90 seconds? Now because my hand is not the one that's going in there, the light will not stay on so I have to automatically put it for like the time that I want it to be. So yeah, so right now I'm just going to place the nail polish colors of what I'm going to use and I guess in the order I'm going to use it, you know, um, each set should have numbers when it comes to Beatles gel polish so you should be able to find what you're looking for pretty easily on Amazon. And I think coming up, uh, most of the frames are like not in frame because yeah, I'm so new to this. Don't worry. Oh yeah, look at this little awkward moment. <laughs> I just want to zoom in so you can see better. Oh, you got it. So yeah, when it comes to like um gel nail polish uh, apply a thin layer all over the nail uh, if you apply too thick it won't dry properly and it will look really bubbly so thin thinner is better and up in a ugh, in this application process and then you can cure it and then apply more if you need it to be more opaque if you need to but do not lay it on thick at all and I like how beggars pizza lay the cheese on thick? Yeah, you're not gonna lay your gel nail polish on thick, okay? Don't do that. And I think for the regular polish color, you can like care for 60 seconds if you want. But I noticed with Beatles gel polish, they're very like opaque on the first coat, honestly. I didn't really have to keep applying. Only time I have to reapply um, one of their coat colors is actually the white coats or the white. Nail no polish color. Oh, good lord. Damn, my laptop is so much noise. Can you hear that? This fan working in overdrive mode. So that's what they look like when you cure them. Um. I don't think I, did I apply the top. Yeah, here we go. So now apply the top gel. Also, with the top gel, is a thicker consistency than the. Um, is it thicker than the regular? I think it's thicker, but I don't know. It's all gel nail polish. It's normally thick anyway. You apply it on all over the nail, same way you apply the nail polish, and then you cure that for 120 seconds. Um, personally, I found out with Beetle nail polish. For me, I do not buff the nails prior or even after. Like some people buff them. And then use like alcohol to wipe it away. Like honestly, like I haven't experienced any chips with the Beatles nail polish. I haven't experienced any cracks, anything that can like pretty much damage the nails quickly because I didn't buff it or whatever that people do. So honestly, I just paint the nails and go about my day, and they last over two weeks. So super affordable, dry quickly, no issues. They're smooth. They're they're perfect. Beatles. 
does a fantastic job with their nail polishes so I highly recommend checking them out and this is so easy to do so and costs way less so yeah this is how they look I cut them and file them to the shape that I like and that was it and they last over two weeks on me bye